gonna have to transfer to another prison. Ow! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> That's some real shit. Now I tell you this. I did this whole protest, whole petition. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. One on one. Yeah, we gonna talk. Listen, I had, and this sounds crazy because people gonna be like, "But well, what the fuck you mean?" If you don't understand what I mean, bitch, shut up. I had an easy ball. I I ripped and ran fucking prison like I was a kindergartner. Yeah, yeah. Like a kindergarten. Yeah, like, yeah. I did not make my time hard. I do what the fuck I got to do. I was cool with certain CEOs, you know what I'm saying? I knew who to mess with, who not to mess with, and I had my way. Yeah. Just do what the fuck you got to do to get up out of here. I got an out date. I don't live here. I'm just visiting. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of life is in prison. Bitch, you up in here making it hard for them. Do you think life is want to be locked in their fucking cell because your ass with two and a half, two to five up in here, you want to take the damn spoon and you want to go over there and do hell bone on it? This is stupid shit. No, you know, that's real. Bitch, smoke in a fucking vent and fall down to break their back. Make it everybody's just, time hard. That's the way they be doing it. I know everything. it. A CEO would rather lock your ass in than deal did, with did you. Did you ever have mm -hmm. to transfer to another prison? Oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> so, when I got classified, I got classified to a minimum, but I was already dug in at the max. So, I didn't want to stay. So, I did this whole protest petition, which is... <laughs> <laughs> this is some real shit. Now I tell you this. I did this whole protest, whole petition. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. I went up there and told you know we, we, you you can't tell these people you want to stay at their prison. If your ass time for you to go, it's time for you to go. You, to go. you know what I'm saying? I told them I don't want to go. I want to stay here because my girlfriend was there and that bitch was a level four and I was a level two and I know she could never come to the the middle. Middle. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So they like me. They fuck with me. So they told me, all right, you can stay. You know they let you stay. They let me stay at the minimum. Min me at the max. At the max. At the max. Check the out. I told you I dealt with that bitch the whole time I was there. You know what I'm saying? Towards the end this bitch, when, when she knew I was getting parole, people do shit to get your date right. took. You know what I'm saying? And she was just doing shit to make me want to <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I, I, I want to beat this bitch up every day. She just doing shit. She cheating on me with crackheads. <laughs> Bitches whose shoes is talking when they walk the bottom flat. You know what I'm saying? Bitches who got three teeth in the possible. Bitches who got two ponytails in the possible. All different type of stuff. Um, she, I don't I had to ask the bitch, is you on your way to being a crackhead? Is you on a crackhead in training? Because everybody you cheat with got a fucking addiction. You know, Ew. long story short, um, I realized what she was trying to do, and me and her wasn't vibing. I'm like, let me get the fuck up off of here. Now, let me get from out of here. Now, before I tried to do that, um, I tried to talk to somebody else. It was this little white chick. That's like, she was nice. You know what I'm saying? This <laughs> like a fake ass Kardashian. You know, I was, I want to have my little girl. This bitch gonna tell me, you know, they want now they want to fight everybody. Her yeah. and the little dyke crew. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> they she, got a, she got a wild pack of dykes. <laughs> and these motherfuckers want to fight everybody uh, uh, who talked to me. You know, she didn't want to recruit the rest of the dykes. Damn. And then, and, and, bitch, you mad. As long as you on this campus. Da, 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 da. And she was making my time very miserable. Yeah. yeah you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, my weight, I was stressed out because she was annoying me. And I can't just take off on a bitch because I'm finna go home. And this bitch done turned six, uh, six months into five years. Damn. Let's be real. You know what I'm saying? She really turned six months to five years. Yeah, yeah. Um, so how it goes, uh, one of the sergeants, um, he knew what she was doing. You know, because it was it was apparent. It's it was it's everybody. Everybody. It's, I mean, prison is big, but it's small. Mm -hmm. So everybody knows everybody's business. And the staff members, they don't get involved with a lot of shit. But I really had favor on me. It just is what it is. One of them sergeants, he seen her. Me and her got into it one day. That sergeant, um, I stayed away. I stayed away. I quit my job in the kitchen because I didn't want to see her. Um, I stayed in my cell or whatever. Long story short, she said some um, she said some crazy shit to one of them other staff members. They locked their ass in the hole, gave her 90 days. Oh, damn. So when I went up, when I found out she was in the hole, oh, I'm out. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you're trying, to, yeah, she's trying you know? to figure out how to keep you in there. Yeah. So when I go to when I go to uh when I go down to the to the child hall, that sergeant told me he said, You go home to your kids. Wow. You go home. That's hard. You know, and he he winked at me. He was a mean motherfucker. McMillan, he uh 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 that's not McMillan. McMillan was the short motherfucker. Uh anyway. He was he was uh he was he was uh he was hard 
you know, but they really had, even though they once said they loved me, I went on ahead, went over to security and put an emergency transfer and I went to another prison. Wow. And that's where I met the other dyke that I saw. Oh, like. damn. <laughs> now, like that dyke over there, you know what I'm saying? She was a whole nigga. <laughs> I don't know how long that bitch had been on those shots, but she was a man. Oh. She was a basketball. That bitch was tall, dressed down. Who was this handsome fella over here? <laughs> you can hardly tell it was a female. Did she bad? Oh, nigga. Her? No, she had them shots, them titties went in her stomach. I don't know where they went to. <laughs> she was muscular and she was tall and them dress was long. But she ain't had surgery though. I don't give a damn. They was like that is gone. Damn. Like what you playing bottle? I ain't seen nothing bouncing or nothing. Uh. You know what I'm saying? And which that that's how it be because one of my Sally over there, she she was going through the shots. That bitch had a fight. She and I'm trying to break up the fight. This I wasn't even a, in a fight. I feel like my ass was whooped. She was so strong. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Like, bitch, go ahead, tie her hand off. Whatever, kill mm. her. I don't know. But they them they, shots, them shots full face you had and every damn Everything. thing. And then a bitch was trying to get me in the cell with her, but I know them shots give you a little thing thing. You not finna, you not finna touch me with that thing. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry, moving a little bit too fast. I leave in 30 days. You know, I wanna get to know you first. <laughs> oh, it's crazy. I, I, it's what's cr the crazy, sorry. Go ahead, I'll let you um, go. What's the, um, cause I know you talk about you've been in a fight and stuff like that. Was your fight the worst fight you've ever seen in prison? Absolutely not. What's My the worst? fight was the was the um, the necessary fight because it, it that fight I had it changed the uh, the dynamics of shit because that bitch was running that camp that camp is raggedy, you know what I'm saying? So it changed the dynamic. It changed prison for me, you know, because I became. So what's hard. the worst fight you've ever seen? So my folks blue. <laughs> I, I got a friend named Blue, <laughs> Blue and Rashida. They was girlfriends, you know what I'm oh, saying? Blue's okay. a stud, Rashida's a little funny looking ass chick. I don't give a fuck. She's a funny looking ass chick, you know what I'm saying? They get in tool with this, uh, this, 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 this Mexican stud. Finding a motherfucker. Little hombre over there, <laughs> tall, lean, like handsome. This is a handsome bitch. You know what I'm saying? Swagged out, come from, I don't know which come from, but it's like, damn, you sure you're in the right prison? Because she was <laughs> handsome as hell. But they get into it. Uh, supposedly, Blue, I, have to say, I should have put Blue on the fucking phone. But Blue, uh, Rashida supposedly, was, now Rashida has some money. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So Rashida was supposed to be over there, you know, licking clit with just a handsome stud. You know what I'm saying? And then came back and told Blue, and Blue, Blue was like, I right, fucked that. I'm finna get on this bitch ass. You know what I'm saying? They had been going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And Rashida, listen, if your bitch get on somebody, you better get on them too. We gonna fight together. I was looking out the window, and I, all I see is Rashida and Blue. I, this, this was a game fight right here. I was talking about, <laughs> they, they, they were, nah, 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 I'm right, was fucking it up. But they was tan her ass up. His, I'm, his, 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 his ass up. You know what I'm saying? But end up breaking his, uh, breaking his leg and ankle and shit. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.